This solution showcases integration between native VMware Kubernetes and Bitfusion. vSphere 7 now natively supports Kubernetes with Tanzu Kubernetes Grid, also known as TKG, and through supervisor clusters embedded in the hypervisor. vSphere Bitfusion introduced with vSphere 7 enables sharing of GPUs over the network. Bitfusion server virtual machines have GPUs allocated to them. With vSphere 7, Bitfusion is integrated via plugin to vCenter. The GPU server cluster is shown here. We can see more details about a specific server here. Here we can see the supervisor cluster with three control nodes. Kubernetes workload management is new in vCenter 7 and helps manage VMware TKG and supervisor clusters. TKG guest cluster virtual machines are shown here. We use this client machine to access TKG guest cluster. We can now see the nodes belonging to the cluster. The configuration file has the necessary tokens used to access the TKG guest cluster. Similarly, the other Kubernetes environments have configuration files that are used for access. A Tanzu Kubernetes Grid Integrated Cluster, or TKGI, previously known as VMware Enterprise PKS, was set up to show its interoperability with Bitfusion. Log in to the TKGI cluster and its nodes are shown. Bitfusion can be enabled at the VM level in vSphere 7, as shown here. The components of the client used to access the GPUs remotely are shown. We can observe that the Bitfusion client can be used to access GPUs. The Bitfusion client components used from within a Docker container are shown. By injecting Bitfusion client components inside containers, capabilities to access GPUs over the network is enabled. We now see the YAML file used to run PyTorch. Note that you can vary the percentage of GPU used using the highlighted variable. We now see the YAML file used to run TensorFlow. In this example, we have requested for three quarters of the GPU to be used. In the first use case, we run a TensorFlow trading exercise in a TKG guest cluster followed by running a TensorFlow benchmark. One can see the utilization of the GPUs from vCenter, leveraging the Bitfusion plugin. Note that we're using three quarters of the GPU capacity. The benchmark run is completed and the results are shown. We now run the TensorFlow benchmark on TKGI cluster. The benchmark run is completed and the results are shown. In this use case, we see PyTorch being used for training from a supervisor cluster. The pods in a supervisor cluster run directly on the hypervisor and show less overhead than a guest cluster. The benchmark run is completed and the results are shown. In summary, VMware Cloud Foundation with vSphere 7 has two key new features. Native support for Kubernetes, Bitfusion which enables sharing of GPUs across the network. This solution showcased integration between Kubernetes and Bitfusion. vSphere Bitfusion can be used over the network from Kubernetes for machine learning. TKG Guest, Supervisor and Integrated Kubernetes Cluster can leverage Bitfusion seamlessly for GPU access in machine learning. Music